hardest working woman in show business is with us right now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, Sarah Wayne Cow is uh, so popular in the original Prison Break that she was brought back to the show a year after her character, also named Sarah, was decapitated. It happens. <laughs> Now a prison How? break. Oh, <laughs> but it did. <laughs> prison break is back. That was a fake head that was yeah. in that. Yeah. yeah okay. Uh huh. And the love of her life has also come back from the dead. I got the note. I got the note, Michael. Look, my name isn't Michael, and I don't know who you are. I'm sorry. You're insinuating that he did this disappeared just quit on his life i want answers just like you do who's capable of this only a handful of people in the world sarah sarah uh -huh. sarah and sarah good morning thank you very much Welcome. good morning is that a moment of relief or betrayal when you find out that the man who's the father of your son has been alive for seven years and hasn't helped you with not one nighttime feeding? Oh, don't that wait. is just anger. Wait, wait a second. Feel... Don't get mad at me. <laughs> <laughs> That's what she channels. Yeah. I, I mean, like the channeling. The, yeah. I, I think it's very much a like, I'm sorry. Yeah. Where have you been? Could, could there, <laughs> could there be justification? Yes, and I think that's probably the second thought. Okay. I think once she kind of calms yeah. Or do, down you, do you think, bit. I thought I knew this guy. I don't know him at all. Well, you know, there's, I think the whole first four seasons of Prison Break took place over 12, maybe 18 months. Mm -hmm. And so I think there's a very serious question about, you know, maybe I was just, he's brilliant. Maybe I was another piece in that And, and is this real game. time? It's been, what is it, how many years since Prison Break? Seven. Is this seven years later? It sure is. It is. Yeah. So, it They're not well. trying to make us look like we did seven years ago, by the way, it, because that would be weird. Right. But impossible. <laughs> Um, last night, it, it, the new season or the new episodes had started, and it did well. You must be encouraged. Everyone must be encouraged. I, you know, it's the television marketplace is so different than right. it was, and our technology has changed so much. I feel like so many people have come to the show through Netflix and through yes. streaming services, and now they're watching it live for the first time. It's just a whole new world. Well, it, when it went away, it didn't go away. That's the strange part of yeah. it. Yeah. And that's the thing about television now, is people can find a show after it's off the air. And binge watch it. And then it. it gets this, yeah, yeah, and it gets this new life. Yeah. yeah. Uh, were you sh shocked, surprised? What was the phone call like? Well, it's the second time I've had this phone call, because I was, I was killed off the show. Exactly. Right. I mean, it's the second time they've called me. The first time they called me for season four, they called me on April 1st. And I was like, oh, that's sure. hilarious. Yeah, sure. Click. And so they call back yeah. the next day. They're like, can we have this conversation today? Um, this time was a strange conversation, but you know what? I'm, I just feel tremendously blessed to do what I do for a living. I'm a working actor. Wait, that's a win. What was the strangeness in the conversation? The, the show that's off the air and has been off the air for such a long time uh -huh. is going to be coming back. And we've got Wentworth and we've got Dominic and we've got Paul Schering. And, um, and we're going to shoot it in Vancouver, which is my backyard. I mean, right. it was amazing. I mm -hmm. jokingly. Half jokingly said the hardest woman working woman in show business. You have another series it's called it, Colony. I do. We were just picked up yesterday for our third season. Congratulations! Um, thank yes, you so yes. much. Thank wanna, you. Yeah. So you want to see it? We got it right here. You Good. do? Yeah. I yeah, do. Yeah, season season three. What is that? I think it's a number station. Old spy trick used to learn the Cold War. The numbers only make sense to someone who knows what they're listening for. So we need a code book. No, I didn't leave one behind, did she? You think we're that lucky? What are you doing there? So that's the season finale. Um, we're trying to figure out how to save our children before Los Angeles falls apart. We all are. It's a documentary. Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> it's a documentary. Um, <laughs> I'll tell you what. It's happening right now. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> these, these are live camera crews <laughs> running yeah. around. Yeah. I'll tell you what. Yesterday was one of the most amazing days of my career. I wrapped on a National Geographic miniseries that we shot in Texas. We shot at Fort Hood. And yesterday was um, the anniversary of the battle in Sadr City where eight American soldiers were killed. Mm -hmm. And so before we shot the scene, some of the soldiers were there and some of the families that had lost people were there. And the actors and the soldiers all got together and we had a moment of silence and we read the names of the dead. I got on a plane, got off the plane and discovered that they picked up Colony for a third season and then Prison Break aired. And I'll tell you, 
that just felt like one of the most amazing yeah, days that in was a career. one day that's that was a, one day that's a career that was yeah there are so many more people far better than I am who aren't working and I just I'm so bloody grateful to be here. You're emotional yeah. about it. Too. Yeah, yeah. I get to support sure. my kids. I'm a working mom. Do you know what I mean? Like, mm -hmm. this is this is the dream. Yeah. And how many kids do you have? Two. Two kids. So All right. Uh, comedy season finale airs tomorrow night on the USA Network. Yes, it does. Prison Break airs Tuesday night here on Fox. The documentary of the National Review, that's coming up. <laughs> you are and, the hardest working and, woman and in show And also, she just announced a remake of The Three Stooges. You're playing Mo. <laughs> I'm playing all three Stooges, okay. actually. All three Stooges. See you. Congratulations. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Very nice. Sarah Wayne Kelly.